Dude, Raymond, how are you, man? I'm great, how are you? I gotta tell you, I'm good, thank you. This movie was so good. <laughs> thank you so much. But I wanna give anything away, but I wanna say, why is it, okay, there are sad parts in this, why does it have to be so sad? Ah, uh, oh, it's Pixar. You know, they can really, they know how to pull your uh, your strings. They it came out of nowhere. I know, They they especially there's so many scenes where it's like, why did that have to happen? And I was literally, I was reading the script and I was like, please tell me there's like another altered version, like where the, none of this happens, <laughs> yes. where it's all joy. <laughs> but uh, there's a, it's Pixar, so they really do know how to make you cry and only Pixar can really do it, that. Like, I'm like, okay, it's called The Good Dinosaur. It's not the I now feel really sorry for dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's uh, yeah, you, yeah, there's so many scenes where you literally like, you feel bad for Arlo and, Oh, they're just, I was watching and I, I cried four times in the theater. Four times. I cried through the whole thing and I, I messed up this eye so I can only cry out of my left <laughs> eye. So I have all those tears coming no out of my way. left eye. And then people are like on the other side are like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Although the people on the right think I'm not crying. Exactly, exactly. Uh -huh. You must have had the time of your life doing this. It oh, was I so did. fun, right? I totally did. I, I, yeah, really, I had the best time. This is really a dream of mine to work with Pixar. Mm -hmm. Just a minor role would, would make me happy, but to be a title character is, Ooh, it's 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 amazing. How did you find the voice for Arlo? So I got the when I got the audition, it just said Pixar, so it didn't have dinosaur or anything involving. But it. you knew, like I got to work on some voices now. I that's the thing, I didn't do it. Okay. I was just like, okay, I'm just gonna you know use my regular voice because I thought uh, maybe this is like a commercial for like a new Pixar movie coming out. So I did my regular voice. Later on, I found out that it was a movie. And I played Arlo, who's a dinosaur, and I was like, wait, 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 should I put a character to it? And when I got the call back. They were like, uh, I got to the booth up in Emeryville. They sent me up to their facility, and they told me, no, uh, they told me, you know, your voice is amazing. You know, it totally fit. I was like, okay. Dude, I get told that all the time. Thank Re you. See, you, it makes sense. I know why. <laughs> I know why. Was the roar you? The, which one? The like, one that comes after? The howl or the roar? Okay, howl and roar. The howl's me. Howl, prove it. That took really. <sighs> you can't say something's you and then not prove it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then the ro okay. You're still gonna try. So the ro and then the roar. I'm still gonna do it. I'm, okay. You I'm, have I'm to do it. it. Okay. I just did it this morning, but my voice is like <laughs> a long time. And <laughs> my voice has been talking for a while, so I'm not sure how this is gonna work. But we'll 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 get it somehow. Okay. And then the it. roar. The, which one? What? Like how many did you do? There's well, there's one roar that was me because it was like a screaming kind of roar. Yeah. But then one they did like a like a. A back kind of like well, T-Rex kind and of And how do you find your roar? Like, are you at home practicing in front of the mirror? Like, are you just like, roar? Like, oh, look, you, I can roar. You had so, there was, it was funny. Pete was trying to get me to roar. I could not do it. I was like, Pete, we might as well just change the script. I cannot do this. But now all your friends are going to want you to roar. You're going to oh, be exactly. at Christmas with your family. They're going to want you to roar. There's, a, they, there's an app called Dub Smash. And yeah. there's there's a one that says Arlo Roar, Arlo Howl. I'm like, and people are doing it. And they're sending it to me. And it's really weird, but it's, it's pretty cool at the same time. Did you have to learn tons about dinosaurs to do this? Like, did you have to study dinosaurs to not be Arlo? Not dinosaurs. I learned about the Apatosaurus. I didn't know what the Apatosaurus was. So first off, I had to get what he looked like, and then I just started getting facts from the dinosaurs eventually, uh -huh. and uh, it really helped me to bring out my inner Apatosaurus when I got into the booth. Okay, Tyranno. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Okay, uh, Stego. Stegosaurus. Okay, Plato. Puss. <laughs> Plato Saurus. Puss. I'm just kidding. Wait, Apto Plato Platosaurus? Yeah. Is that a dinosaur? Yeah. Is that really? I guess. Apto. Aptosaurus. The. Okay. <laughs> that sounds like a book. Yeah. Why are we Why are we naming? <laughs> what are we doing? I'm quizzing you on your thesaurus, your orises. I learned about the. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> and oh, you I, failed. I, I did. A patasaurus. That's all I need to know, and that's all the facts I need. How fun was it that the human was the pet? I love the like the it reverse was, on it this. It was such a great thing. You know, uh, Pixar knows how to uh, make great storylines. Yeah. Especially, and they really know how to make you cry as well. So they were able to make that weird storyline that not a lot of people would think of where they would switch a boy and a dog story. And uh, yeah, so when the Arlo is the, really the boy and the boy is the dog, yeah. it's such a great story. You would think it'd be weird by hearing it, but later on after you watch the movie, you really get touched by it. And that's why I think you cry because it is really emotional. Can you imagine living in a world where dinosaurs still were around and people were like the pets? Oh, the dinosaurs so... were the smart ones? That'd be like, so would, cool. Would Earth be better? I'm not sure. Because if, wait, are the, is it like, are the humans like Spot though? Can they talk? 
Uh, I think the humans would be like, no, I think they would just be, because who would teach them to talk? Where are they going to learn language from? This is very true. Okay. Because I would be like, that'd be pretty cool if you can be like, hey, let's go ride on my pterodactyl and let's go fly somewhere. Yeah. But if you can't do that and they're just roaming around you, that'd be really weird. And like there'd be no cars, so your your Uber is a dinosaur. Exactly. Uh Uh-huh. You have to worry about that being a... No. Oh my god, I could talk to you for hours, but we're being wrapped up. (laughs) (laughs) So thank you so much. Let's end on this. Why should people see this? Because it is it's a family film. You can take your you can you can be an adult and go by yourself and not feel weird because it's Pixar and you grew up with it. Or you can take your family because they're gonna enjoy it, you're gonna enjoy it. It's a touching movie and it's just it's a great movie in general. It's Pixar. Come on. You know it's gonna be good. Kiss.